I'm gonna be showing you guys everything you can get inside of the new New Year's crate inside of the dodgeball game mode in Blade Ball. Now before we begin, I am giving away these packs to a random subscriber. All you guys gotta do is subscribe, hit that notification bell, leave a like on this video, and just attend one of our live streams, which you will likely be pinged on Discord. So if you have it, go for it. And let's break a hundred likes on this video. I know we can do it. Just do whatever it takes to smash that like button. I believe in you guys. Now without further ado, let's check out the crate. So if we go over here, you can grab this crate from winning a dodgeball game mode. And there are one, two, three, four, five, six, seven items you can get. The rarest being a 1% app. Now I'm going to be showcasing every single thing you guys can get inside of this thing. So let's start with the most common thing, which is the 26% New Year's Blade. This is the new New Year's Blade. It has no special effects to it. Nothing that good. In my opinion, it doesn't look that great. And if we go into, uh, now we are here in the game. We're going to see if this weapon will indeed be worthwhile or not. We turn on infinity right here and nope, there is no SFX or anything guys. Oh. I guess we won. Next up, I'm going to be showcasing you guys the Time Stopper weapon. As you can see, there is no SFX on it, but this is what it looks like normally. Oh, I died. Let's just run up infinite. This is what it looks like normally when we get it. And that's that. Next would be the Firework Spear. Right this. There's nothing to it as well. As you can see, there is absolutely no SFX to any of these unless they plan on adding it. But this is what they look like currently. Come on, bot. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, I win. And now we have the rarest sort of them all, the Axe of Time. This FYI, I am on max graphics. So this is what it looks like on max graphics. It, look, it has some fireworks going to it. It has some special effect. There is no SFX on the slash yet, but other than that, it looks pretty good. For a free weapon, this is not bad, considering it's for New Year's. Now we have two new explosions. I already showcased these two on my previous video on the weapon showcase, so you guys can check that out on my channel. But these are the two new ones, the 2024 explosion and the Happy New Year explosion. Let's equip the 2024 explosion. So we're going to grab this real quick, and we just got to beat this bot up. So let's go, Mr. Bot. Let's see. Come on. I'm better than the bot. I'm better. I'm better. I'm better. I'm better. Come on, Mr. Bot. Mr. Bot, come on. Oh, that's what it looks like. That's the first explosion, guys. Now let's run up the new Happy New Year's explosion. Okay, Mr. Bot, round two. Mr. Bot, you got a second chance, Mr. Bot. Let's go, Mr. Bot. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Oh, this is the New Year's explosion, as you guys just saw. Let me showcase it to you guys one more time, because this one is actually better than the normal one. Mr. X Bot, Mr. Bot. Come on, Mr. Bot. Flash of the century, guys. Oh, there we go. It says Happy New Year and has all those fireworks on it. Now we have the final two things you can get from the crate, which is the firework emote. So if we run that firework emote again, oh, emotes are disabled. There we go. It shoots up randomly and it seems like something happens. It's not happening right now, but this will probably launch into a firework once they release the game. And here we have the cartwheel emo. It's just a basic cartwheel. There we go. Those are everything you can get from the new dodgeball game mode. Thank you all for watching. Subscribe if you have not already. And see you guys in the next one. Peace out, guys.